Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today's video I was going to do something a little bit different. I wanted to just sit down and have a chat about our travel plans for this year. So we really like travelling as a family. We don't get to do it all that often. We don't go on like big fancy expensive holidays um, very much but even if it's just travelling in the UK we really just love to get out and explore. So I really enjoy watching videos like this and um, chatting to people about what their travel plans are and I love seeing people's travel photos and blog posts and Instagram posts and things like that. Um, so yeah, I thought I would just let you know what we're planning for this year. So last year we actually had quite a few holidays um, and I might as well just tell you what we did last year. So the first holiday that we had was in March and that was to North Wales. We've never been to Wales before so it was really nice to get over there and explore. And then in May, I think it was the first week of May, we went to Wales again but this time it was to Bluestone in South Wales which was really nice. And then at the end of May, which was the Springbank school holiday, we went to Butlins um, which we just absolutely love Butlins so that was that, that was really good. And where did we go to after that? In June we had a long weekend to Sherwood Hideaway Luxury Lodges. We've been there for the past, I think, three or maybe four years now and we absolutely love it there. Um, hoping that we'll be able to go back again this year. And then in July, the end of July, the first week of the school holidays, we went on a little bit of like a, a road trip. We went and stayed down in Hastings and we basically just drove out every day to different places. So we got to see Hastings, we got to see Brighton, Margate, Eastbourne, lots of different places in the area. And that really is my perfect kind of holiday. I just love doing that and seeing loads of different places that otherwise we wouldn't get to see because like Brighton, for example, I've wanted to go to for such a long time, but living up in Sheffield, it's not the kind of place that you can go for a day trip, so um, you kind of have to go there while you're on holiday. And then after that, it was my 30th birthday in August, and my husband surprised me with a trip to Granada in Spain. So we did that in the October, just me and him. The kids stayed with my mum. It was three nights and it was really, really good. It was amazing to see, you know, such a beautiful city and just have a bit of time just away, just the two of us. And then finally, we went to Disneyland Paris in November, which is something that we've wanted to do for a really long time. Obviously it costs a lot of money. We had to save up for it for quite a long time. Um, but it was it was great, it was really really good and we would love to go again. So that's last year. This year is not quite as exciting <laughs> as last year. We're going to try and keep things to a minimum and save a little bit of money. Um, but the first holiday that we've got planned is next week um, and that is to Fiorteventura and that's going to be like an all-inclusive holiday. Um, really excited about that, need to get packing. We will be staying in an area called Coraleo and I will link the hotel that we're staying in in the description if anybody's interested and you want to check it out. Um, I definitely will be vlogging and there'll be some blog posts and um, also Instagram posts, Instagram stories and things. So if you're not following me over on Instagram and you would like to, then my link is in the description or just search for at Emma plus three and I will come up. So yeah, that's our first holiday. We have also booked to go to Italy in July again that's the first week of the summer holidays and we're actually going with Eurocamp, uh, it's actually a review holiday which is really good and um, obviously the accommodation is provided but we have paid for our own flights and things. So we're staying at a site near Venice so we're going to be hiring a car so that we can have some day trips to Venice and there is also um, Verona close by as well so it'll be really exciting to see Italy. I've never been and I've always wanted to go so I'm really looking forward to that. So that's actually everything that we have booked at the moment um, and obviously that is more than enough. If we can afford it, we were, would love to go back to Butlins. When we went last year, we went in the Springbank holiday at the end of May, which was perfect. The weather was lovely. Um, so ideally we would go then, but I'm not sure whether we're going to be able to afford it. We'll have to wait and see. If you're interested, I did vlog 
um, our last Portland trip, so I'll link those vlogs in the description as well if you're interested in having a look. And then I'm also thinking that maybe in October we will go somewhere, probably just in the UK. Um, so we've been doing this thing where we're trying to visit all of the cities in the UK um, and we've got like a, a little checklist which I bought from somebody on Etsy and I'll link that if you're interested as well and I'll also link a blog post that I wrote about it. Um, obviously visiting all the cities in the UK is going to take us a long time, um, it'll take us years if I'm honest but it's really good to just get out and see places that you wouldn't have otherwise thought to go to. We managed to do quite a few cities last year and it was it was really nice, we really enjoyed it. So hopefully we can do a few more this year and maybe that'll involve a couple of overnight stays or something. I'm considering maybe if we can afford to in the summer holidays having a few nights away uh, somewhere further down south and maybe we can go to a few cities um, while we're there, similar to what we did when we stayed in Hastings last summer. So yeah, maybe we can do that. And then also, like I said, we um, reviewed for Sherwood Hideaway Luxury Lodges last year and also the year before. So if um, we can work with them again, then we would absolutely love to go there again, but um, I'm not sure whether that will happen yet. If not, we might book ourselves because they really are lovely, lovely lodges. They are in it's near Newark in Nottinghamshire, so it's not far from us at all, it's about 45 minutes and it's just really, really lovely around there. So yeah, um, that's everything that we've got planned for this year. I hope that you've found this kind of video interesting and like I said, there will be some travel vlogs coming up um, from our holidays that we've got planned, so please do subscribe if you're interested in seeing those and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and I will see you in my next video. Bye!